Ah, the 70s. Steak was seen as healthy food, James Brown was alive and Emmanuel adult movies were presented in your local cinema. The German watch brand Union Glas Hütte adds now the colors of that legendary time. The new Noramis date is from its specs a conservative watch, but now it comes in a fresh form inspired by 70s cars. Let's go over the basics first. We have an automatic watch with a case diameter of 40 mm, a length lock to lock of 48 and a height of approximately 13 mm, not stated on their website. Lock width is 21. The watch has a sapphire crystal, normal crown, is waterproof up to 100 meters and powered by the UNG07S1. That's basically the ETA 2892A2 with silicon balance spring and a decent power reserve of 60 hours. The watch comes in five different dial colors, red, blue, yellow, green and gray on a leather strap. The price is indicated with 2,400 euros, including VAT, which converts to 2,130 US dollars without VAT. So what's going on here? When you see the watch without the color, then it presents the typical uncluttered design German watchmakers are known for. We have six numerals in a wide and legible font, sharp and precise indices all applied. The minute track holds the dial together and the hands are very simple, loomed and in a perfect length. This inner circle there goes through the middle of the date window, corresponds with the hour hand and goes smoothly around the printed union. The watch has an exhibition case back that shows here that handsome movement. But now to the colors. I will not tell you my favorite because it's somewhat irrelevant, rather a matter of sheer taste. But it's worth mentioning that they opted here for a creamy look. These colors are not super saturated and they are all on the warmer side of the color wheel. Even that blue here is not that sharp, steely, icy blue we know from other manufacturers. It's more suave and that's in my opinion a good decision. Because the problem with loud colors is that it can be hard to combine them with garments. Imagine a green watch with a blue shirt mm -mm, will look terrible in most cases. With this green and a very bright blue dress shirt it might be possible. And overall I really like that this manufacturer just did it. The Uhrenfabrik Union Glashütte was founded in 1893 and is until now without a super cool brand ambassador and this normally leads to very cautious decisions. Can we dare to install there a red accent the size of a dust corn? Oh no, too risky. But Union now has done it with confidence because they have their classic looking watches too. Here you see an older reference in a super dark green and this also looks fantastic. But now let's complain a bit. Let's, let's just grumble a bit so that we don't drift into pure advertising here. Date wheel. When colors are so important, there could be a colored date wheel. Of course, this would demand to produce date wheels in these five colors, but it would deliver a more coherent look, which unfortunately is also a matter of taste. I know quite some people who prefer white date wheels because they really use the date function and black on white is just more legible. Anyway, last point of criticism is the price. 2400 are not complete nonsense. Union is a well-respected brand and the components are top-notch. But it's not some sort of boutique watch. In fact, the old Union company was in business only until 1933 and was revived in the 90s by the Swatch Group. But after all, it's a watch made in Glashütte, made in Germany, so certainly up a tier. But let's agree on something around 2000, please. And with that, please allow me to close this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much and see you next Monday to watch of the week.